All right, now it's time for Talking with Joe. Joe Rose live from the WQAM studios this morning. Joe, good morning. A long night, flight, back to Miami. Well, not too long of a flight. You were in Atlanta, so not too, too far, but still a long day and night for you covering the final preseason game yesterday. So thanks so much for being here with us. Let's talk about that final preseason game for the Dolphins. It looks like a decision perhaps has been made on who will back up Ryan Tannehill. Brock Osweiler seemed to have separated himself last night. What do you think of his performance? Well, I think like most people and getting a chance to call that game last time, I was a little surprised. <laughs> the Miami Dolphins and Brock Osweiler came out and scored 21 points and, Good surprise. and played basically <laughs> perfect football in the first quarter. 21 points, 16 to 25, couple of touchdowns uh, made later on in the game, made a beautiful throw on a back shoulder touchdown. So Brock Osweiler, uh, it didn't look like as we were – finishing up after that game nobody was happier than Brock Osweiler <laughs> and there were some other guys that played well but but he was definitely right up there knowing that he needed to play well and he did all right well good for him so he had a good night last night overall who do you think helped themselves in this final preseason game and who do you think hurt themselves last night well, let's start with this because th this group of guys that played most of this game were awful <laughs> last week against oh. Baltimore, awful in the second half. They came out in this one. Jordan Lucas, uh, safety, had an interception, also had a sack. Vincent Taylor, uh, because they're a little shorthanded, had to play. He's been kind of a backup defensive tackle, and he has just had an unbelievable preseason. Torrey McTire was in on some plays. Kalen Balazs was in. In there uh, so there were a handful of guys that really stood out making big plays I'm really curious because you know what today is today is pink slip day at start <laughs> of it and so a lot of guys gonna find out uh, what's gonna happen that'll start leaking out later on in the day probably uh, around noon or so you'll start hearing stuff as the coach has got to make a lot of decisions get that roster down to 53 uh, by tomorrow at 4 o'clock. So a lot of work to do, trying to figure out. I still think the Dolphins will be looking to see what everybody else does. But uh, a good game for a lot of guys yesterday. I was really happy. I know it's that fourth preseason game. They get bad. Hey, we'll When's the regular it. season we'll going to start? It. <laughs> but a lot of guys played really well, and it was a good feeling. And, it sure Joe, was. you always say you can't ruin a Friday, but something tells me some guys are going to have a pretty bad Friday later on today. So... We'll be keeping yeah. an eye out for who gets those You know those what? Pink that, that's going to change. You're right. <laughs> There's going to be some guys that said, Joe Rose, shut up. Uh -huh. You can ruin a Friday when you find out you're not in the NFL anymore. Mm. That's what the NFL stands for. We wish for. them well, not though. For we'll long. wait and see. We'll yeah. wait and see, Joe. And we will see you in the yeah, next hour. That's right. Thanks so much. You got it.